Hello everyone, I'm Zhong Chai. We would like to thank Fox Foundation give us this opportunity to speak today. We are going to speak about preclinical evaluation of feedback control of ultrasound induced blood brain barrier open via Nemifast system. Nemifast, which is a clinical proposed for ultrasound system, has been developed for fast energy guidance. We combine neural navigator and the NEMIFAST to guide folks' ultrasound energy to the target. A 256 element transducer was employed, and therefore, this system could steer the focus point. In our previous NEMIFAST version, the passive cavitation feedback control was not implemented and we observed the inhomogeneous of the PVB opening results due to the individual scalp penetration variation and the prediction uncertainty. Therefore, to tackle this, this study aimed to develop a real-time acoustic emission feedback control algorithm that can be implemented in our next clinical trial. To implement the feedback control, 16 out of 256 elements were randomly chosen to real-time receive backscatter emission. The performance of the developed algorithm was tested via animal experiments, including 17 rats and two swines. Events Blue and the Tito Star weighted MR imaging were employed to evaluate the level of BBB opening and the red blood cell extravasations. The real-time feedback control algorithm is like this. The echo signal was transformed to acoustic emission change based on energy spectrum density. The feedback control procedure includes two stages. First stage is ramp stage, which acoustic level would be increased until a change reached ceiling threshold. In the following summing case stage, the acoustic level would be decreased until a change less than floor threshold and continuously proceed the exposure to the end. In red experiment, left column shows low BBB open occurrence, which the acoustic level fixed at a low pressure and the right column shows 100% PPV open occurrence. Yet, historical examined demonstrated extensive RPC intravasation. In the group applying the real-time feedback control algorithm, 100% PPV open accessible rate can be induced, and limiting the RPC intravasation effect to be minimal. In SWAN experiment, the successful rate was 100%, and again, the occurrence of RBC intravasation is nearly 0%. In conclusion, we have successfully developed an acoustic emission feedback control to optimally open the BVB and can be implemented in the NEMI file system. Currently, this algorithm has been implemented in our current clinical trial that combined the BB opening to enhance the delivery of Avastin for recurrent GBM patients. Thanks for your attention.